One of the good things about Mac OS X is that it can handle many different languages. But that means that it also comes with many Asian fonts that just clutter up your font lists if you don't speak those languages. Here's how to hide these fonts to reduce clutter and keep you from accidentally choosing one of these Asian fonts by mistake. If we open the fonts window in a word processor such as TextEdit, we can see several font collections that have the fonts that we want to hide. Let's zoom in on this a bit for a better look. There are Chinese, Japanese, and Korean collections. As I click on each collection name, the fonts in that collection appear in the typeface column. These are the fonts that I want to hide. To do the hiding, I'll use the Fontbook application. This program comes with Mac OS X, 10.4 Tiger and later, and you'll find it in your Applications folder. Here in Fontbook, you can see the same Asian font collections over in the Collections column. If I select one of them, the fonts in that collection appear, along with a preview of the font. What I want to do is turn the fonts off so that they're hidden from the system and all of its programs. The easiest way to do it is to select an Asian font collection, then go to the Edit menu and choose Disable. You can disable the whole collection, in this case it's called Chinese, or you can disable individual fonts in the collection, like the Hay family selected here. After you disable a font or font collection, it dims in the font book window and the word off appears next to it. Continue disabling additional fonts or font collections. When you're done, you can quit Fontbook. Back in the text edit fonts window, we can see that the collections we turned off no longer appear, and that's all there is to it. For more great Mac tips and tricks, go to askthemacgeek.com. Mm -hmm.